Smile. And uh, we begin in Nairobi. Now, police are waiting to arrest members of parliament from the northeastern region on arrival at the Wilson Airport from Somalia. Reports indicate that the MPs made the trip to Somalia without authorization. And our sources also tell us that their luggage could be searched on arrival for contraband. And if it's Olive Barrows is at the Wilson Airport and now joining us live for more details, Olive. Good afternoon, Zainab, coming to us from uh, Kiambu County. Well, I'm at the Wilson Airport, as you mentioned, and uh, the limited information we have is that eight members of parliament from Northeastern are expected to be arrested for traveling to the nation without authorization. They're either meant to get that authorization from the Speaker of the House or from the Ministry of Foreign Affairs. Now, on arrival, as you mentioned, they will be subjected to a search to determine uh, whether or not they are ferrying contraband into the country. Now, behind me, is the VIP pavilion and we saw what looks like um, flying squad vehicles parked waiting uh, for the members of parliament to disembark and then be arrested. It's then expected that they will be transported to the Wilson police station which is just a few meters ahead of us. Now if you, if you just I'll ask my cameraman to pan a little bit so that you can get a sense of uh, how big a story this is. We have various people from various media houses, national media houses also covering this story. Now, you'll know that Kenya and Somalia have been embroiled in a boundary dispute. So the relations between the two nations are tenuous at best. There have previously been delegations that have traveled to Somalia in an effort to mend ties between the two nations. Now, that is the information we have so far. Once we have more information on exactly what the objective of their visit was and whether they attained it and uh, why they did not seek authorization. We will be bringing that information to you. But as of now, the information we have is that there are eight members of parliament from the northeastern region who f will face arrest for what some say is a treasonable offense of traveling to the nation without authorization. That authorization should be given to them ideally either by the Speaker of the House or by the Ministry of, of Foreign Affairs and it's said that they have not received that authorization.